find anything out? Tell Quentin everything you know, advise him to let the past go. He didn't even fucking reply. He's just like, huh, okay. Some things are better left in the past. We'll see what he says. Maybe he'll actually say something, or he's just running off to go sit on the floor. Not good. So, the sheriff called you Alex. Shit. I was really hoping you didn't notice that. Yeah, about that. Yeah, I'm sure you have your reasons for changing your name. As far as I'm concerned, they're yours. So, yeah, I'm not gonna pry. But if you do ever want to talk about it... I... Thank you. You know what? I just realized... Be Need something? Hey! Billy's Billy. <laughs> Becca sounds like Lily, which is why I just accidentally combined their names. Need something? You good? You all good? All right, that went that went down that nicely. Rings. Is that it? Hey, how are you? Hey, how are you? I'm good. I'm just wondering how you're able to talk perfectly fine with a mouthful of beans. Hmm. Magic man. Oh well. I really wonder what the Wilkerson's were up to. Uh, I hope that doesn't glitch me out. Fucking some important story mission shit coming in, and Daniel's just like, "Hey, I got the stuff. I'm going back to base. Thanks." No, oh, yeah, yeah, no. I'm really glad you did that. Thanks. Listen to this. I recorded it a little while ago. We've gotten ourselves into a jam. Sounds like they're in a bad spot. I want to offer them a hand. Here's the coordinates. Fucking. You've gotten yourself into a jam? What kind of fucking jam do you get into dealing with an armored zombie? God, I hate these survivors sometimes. Uh, so, one interesting thing that's being done is... Oh, wow, look at all the fucking all the bridges over to the other to the city got destroyed. Anyways, um, there's a sandbox mode being developed right now by Undead Labs for this game. And that sounds kind of interesting. Considering that mostly a lot of people want to just focus on the sandbox aspect, like if it wasn't for half these missions, I don't know. At the same time, I'm a guy who likes having missions to do, like story missions to do, because I like story missions. Uh, you know, they they progress the story, and it's just it, it, it's nice. Even if it even if it might eventually lead to the end of the game, it's nice to have something there that is actually progressing. Uh, you, I don't know. I, 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 it's, it's why I can't get too far into something like Minecraft. It's just like, I would like something to pop up and make something interesting. Hopefully one day there'll be a zombie game that's sandbox, but at the same time able to give you really great procedurally generated or just dynamically added in by the developers content. Story content, that is. Shit. Is he still alive? Yeah, not for long by the look of it. Gotta get out of here. I, I, can't, I can't stay. Easy, soldier. What happened to you? I'm too sick. Left me behind. Left all the sick ones behind. <laughs> Guess that's why they always say, don't drink the water. <sighs> we got a term for this in the army. That term is foobar. You better get going. Oh. Uh, yeah. Okay, sure. What if he turns into a zombie? Okay, I'll just be here. Let me know if he turns. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna search on this. I like how they copy and pasted this. <laughs> right? Like, this is almost identical to the other church. At least in terms of, like... Where's Ed Free here? Like, in terms of this. Where the... Where do the dead go when hell is full? I don't know, but apparently you replicate the exact same conditions of a random church outside the outskirts of the town in the one that's in the towns. Cool. Food jars. All pickled or packed in brine. Cool. Alright. Well, we don't really need food. God, they replicated this too. Eww. I'm leaving. Have fun with whatever you gotta do, Sergeant. Hopefully you don't die of sickness. Ooh. I've been thinking about what our dying friend said about the water. 
Right before they locked me out, the science geeks were talking about something they found up at the reservoir. Now I'm thinking we ought to go check it out. I'm on it. Let's move out then. Oh! Oh, that's a- yeah, see, I knew it was like a damn. <laughs> I was hoping it was an airport. You, you can't- you can't blame me for when I was like, oh, It's an airport! Oh, it's an airport! I see like- I- I- I, I blame... Arba. I just see like a really giant structure that's a rectangle on the map, and I'm like, That... Is an airport. Jesus, fucking zombie hordes. Hey, and you got Oh, jeez. Uh, backing on up. Ooh, that's a fucking pull. Hey, how's it going? Uh, dude, you might want to fucking, like, kick him or some shit. <laughs> he is, like, kicking him. Okay. Would you? Thank you. Get the fuck off my car. Well, oh, right. This fucking random-ass dead end. Alright. So what? Is there a zombie? A dead zombie? Kind of just in the water? Kind of reminds me of, uh... Cabin so fever. In terms of some dead dude you in the water. The Bugged out. Well, the ones that weren't sick or hurt, at least. You saw what they did with them. This whole operation's been a chuckle puck from day one, and your people seem to be the only ones with your heads on the outside of your collective asses. Just sorry your reward for that looks like death by supercar. Oh, hell no! <laughs> oh, Jesus. No, get the fuck off my car! Get off of there! Oh no, the bladder! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit! A better ship! You know, when we first set up camp here, the captain designated this as our R&R &R spot. <laughs> Short of sitting on our bunks jerking off, all we were allowed to do with our free time was come up here, swim a few laps, and try to pretend MREs were suitable barbecue fodder. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> In retrospect, I'm not sure which I regret more. I recognize some of this. It's the same shit the Geek Squad was carting around when they were trying to find out what caused this. What's it do? Fucked if I know. I'm just a professional bullet stopper. They don't waste big words on me. They must have bailed in a pretty big goddamn hurry to leave all this behind. Let's see if we can get a better look. Okay. Uh, I was like, I, I was trying to fucking pop the pills the entire time in that little tiny part, but it wouldn't let me because he was talking. Okay. Oh, shit. Ooh. Yeah, succinctly put. Now, it's been a while since I read my field survival manual, but I'm pretty sure dead guys rotting in your water supply is what's known as a bad thing. We're going to have to leave the valley, aren't we? We can't keep drinking this. Uh, there's only one way out if you don't have air support. The pass back by the fairgrounds. It links up with the main highway after about 10 miles. Trouble is, the army blocked it off when they left. Probably trying to stop whatever this is from spreading. Then how do we get out? I'm not sure yet. I got a couple of leads I can check out. Meantime, your people ought to start stockpiling supplies. I don't know what things will be like on the outside. But I doubt it's good. Okay. Don't drink the water. Well, we weren't drinking the water anyway. Well, I guess we might have been, but... I'm glad we know this information. This wasn't here before. Right? I mean, it was dark, so I couldn't have really seen it, but... Jesus. Ugh. How the fuck did they get into the water supply? It's a bar... Wire fence, and there's like hundreds of them down there. And there's apparently a city up there. If a fucking... If they can get out out of the fence and into the water, surely they can walk up to the fucking city up there. Just saying. We're about as secure as we can be here. Any hordes that come our way are gonna be starved. All right. Uh, do I have to expand my outposts again? Mm, I think I might. I'm not sure. I don't think so. Yeah, we're good. Okay. I'm not sure what. Because, like, alright, I, I think this kind of confirms it. If you just pause your game, like this, time doesn't really get progressed in the simulation. That's very interesting. So if I were to hop offline and just stop playing for 24 hours, shit would happen in the background. But if I pause the game and leave my Xbox on, which isn't a really heavily recommended thing, but if I just did that, 
then that's one way to avoid the problem of, oh shit, half my people died while I was away pl not playing the game. Hmm. Very interesting. I guess that's just one thing to keep in mind. Although I am a little bit annoyed because that means I have to, uh, you know, the fucking, uh... The training survivors thing hasn't gone through just yet. Yeah. I can't wait for, um the updates to come out that reduce the amount of time that takes. You know, while we're here, I might as well go up to the fucking survey point. Is that one of them? Texture load-ins? Gosh, I can only imagine how great this game would look on the PC if they had just developed for the PC. Because it kind of looks like ass because it was purely developed on the Xbox, or rather for the Xbox. But it's the CryEngine, right? The CryEngine delivers amazing looking shit, and we just have some stuff which looks great in a lot of things, but it looks meh. So definitely looking forward to the PC version. Hopefully they, you know, actually, you know, twist a little bit of magic here and there to be like, all right, here's something that looks even better on the PC. I don't know, maybe any aliasing, V-Sync, shit like that. Uh, um, I have no idea what I'm doing, by the way. I'm just kind of driving around trying to find a survey point. Because the survey points are the easiest way to be like, alright, what's what and where? And the only thing I can think of is this. I don't know if there's any st ladders or staircases, but yeah. Fell off a truck. New guns in the farmhouse su supply locker. Ooh, nice. What does that say? Full postal service? Oh, it's just an office. Okay. But you see... I don't know, I see that, and I'm like, oh, I gotta be able to climb that, but I guess not. It doesn't seem like there's any way up there. No ladders? Yep, no ladders on the wire tower. That's a little bit of a risky thing. Alright. Hi! No. Bad zombie. Just trying to find a survey point, because I don't know where they are. This might be one of the places, this might be a place where they're like, No, you have to look up at every house that you want to look into. Yes. But it doesn't really make a lot of sense because they like survey points. Hmm. Just trying to see, where the hell is it? Hey, big man, what's going on? What is that supposed to be? A spool? Uh... Okay, yeah, sure, why, I don't know what this building used to be, or what it was gonna be, but they definitely at least had time to put out the mascot. Big giant dude carrying a spool! I heard you wanted a car! Yeah! What the hell is going on up back here? They got themselves like a nice, a nice little valley that I'm very tempted to go into, at the same time as not. Valleys don't really do a lot of good. Especially if they don't really seem to contain anything. Just saying. Damn it! If only I could run over the trees! Hmm. Maybe that's a survey point. Right? There's gotta be a way to climb some of this shit. I mean, come on. Oh wait, that's the army base. Hmm. Right? Yeah, it was the army base. Okay. Uno momento. You know, for a place that you would think would have, like, a lot of dead army dudes, there aren't really any army dudes around here. At least dead ones. Right? It's just kind of the, the same old, same old. Which just seems kind of weird. It'd be really cool if there was some, like, zombie variants depending on where you are. Like, oh, if you're out here, you get a bunch of farmer zombies. Oh, if you're over there, you get nurse zombies. You're next to the hospital, which... Think about it. Where the fuck is the hospital? Like, I haven't really, like, the, only, the closest thing I've seen to a hospital was the veterinary clinic. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, I want to say the Ferris wheel, as it's the tallest point, is a survey point, but... I can't imagine it'd be a very easy climb, if at all possible, so, fuck it. Oh, well. I'm gonna hey, get out of here. Anybody home at the courthouse? Our scouts are reporting a lot of zombies closing in on your location. Might want to tell your sentries to wake the hell up. Hello? Hello? Uh. Sounds like they're in a bad spot. I want to offer them a hand. Alright, what's going on at the courthouse? What? 
What's up with all the people that want shit? Destroy an armor Zed! Destroy an army Zed! Army Zed? Oh. Like, okay. What? Army Zed, armored Zed. Hmm. Feral zombie. Yeah, alright. I'll get down to there. I just have to get across the bridge. I'm headed out. Alright, that's the bluff. Slow down, because they never bothered to remove the sandbags, the jerkwads. I don't know about you guys, but I would definitely leave some places nice and clear for uh, driving purposes. Right? It's like, oh, I need to drive all the way up there? How about we don't have part of it blocked off? No, so you, just, you, gotta, you gotta block the zombies, even though zombies wouldn't really be able to get past... Or would rather, rather, even though zombies would most likely be able to get past it anyways. Zombies in zombie media generally have a pretty easy time getting past anything that isn't just solid steel. You know? How's this? We're in the field! Yeah, okay. I still don't know what the fuck you look for in the field. Right? Is this like a random box on the side of the area or some shit? Because this is a pretty wide area. Speaking of which... Is this Enclave okay? They're desperate. What am I supposed to do? They don't pop shit up. <laughs> you know? The only things that, 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 that I can do for other people are the main story missions, which aren't the same. What the fuck? Alright, I guess I can help you out. I'm on the move. Roger that. Haha! -ha. I just had some air time right there. Fantastic. Has the drive here? Look, see, there's a field. Just in the really back end corner of this fucking field. Some shit you can search through. Nice. What's that? Giant ass set of boxes? No! Not perfect for putting stuff into. Dude, I was about to say, if this fucking field says there's nothing in it, <laughs> I'm just gonna be slightly agitated. Like, really? Nothing in the field? Bullshit. No, oh, well. How's our trust with these guys, anyways? I mean, it's not even. It even rays, right? Quentin, I just got you, like, a girlfriend. Pretty much. And you didn't. You didn't have to raise up your trust? Alright. Save the survivor! Okay. I will do what I need to. Alright, rebel time, baby. Yeah! Get the hell off him! Ah, oh, it's Caleb! Hey, Caleb! Why are you- wait, Caleb! Caleb isn't- <sighs> Caleb shouldn't be out here. He's like the cook. Right? I'm not actually sure. Let me- let me- let me, let me figure out who the cook is. After I kill this guy. There we go. Alright. Alright, you're safe. Let's go, let's go! Okay. I think I'm ready to head home now. He's a top chef! What the fuck are you doing out here? Jesus, Caleb. Come on. Get in. Thank you. I gotta take you home so you can finish cooking us a decent meal. Uh, whatever decent meal you can get from supplies that I assume would last quite a while. I don't know. All the best stuff in life expires really quickly. Unless you have a freezer. Which I'm pretty sure we don't. Hmm. 